Three things you need to know today. Police released photos of a man suspected of shoplifting at the Kendig Square Kmart. The man was observed taking merchandise from the Kmart on Sunday. He then fled in a small blue SUV. Anyone with information is asked to contact West Lampeter Township Police. An inmate rights group in Lancaster wants officials to make plans for a new prison to replace aging buildings. Have a heart for persons in the criminal justice system. Ask the prison board to create a 10-year plan to replace Lancaster County Prison. Prison officials said keeping this existing facility functional for another decade would cost about $26 million in repairs. Building a new facility could cost up to $170 million. Democratic Vice Presidential nominee Tim Kaine will stop in Lancaster this evening. This stop is part of a two-day statewide tour. The event is at the Boys and Girls Club of Lancaster at 229 West Lemon Street. Doors open at 4 and the event starts at 6. That's going to do it for us today. Be sure to check out our website, Lancaster Online, and to follow us on social media. I'm Ryan Mellon. Have a great day. At Lancaster General Health, we are here to keep this community healthy and well, to give you every option to live the life you want to live. That's why we've joined Penn Medicine, Pennsylvania's number one ranked health system, to bring you local access to the world's most advanced research and one-of-a-kind clinical trials that are leading to one-of-a-kind cures. Your life is our legacy, and to us, that's worth everything.